up, what's up? Girl just woke up, bed hair, red face, no lashes on, nothing. I'm actually going to be packaging my first orders from my website. So I'm so excited to show you guys. I just wanted to like vlog this process. Let me set this camera up and let's package these orders. Now I have all of my Depop stuff ready to be packaged. So I'm gonna package these up first and I'm going to package up my website's orders. I have some baby fat shoes that sold. I have this beautiful jacket that sold. And she also bought this houndstooth blazer. And then I sold another bundle. It was this really cool retro set. So this color block set with the matching purple pants and some Levi's jeans. These were brand new. Oh, something just flew out of here. And I can't believe I found these at the thrift store. This other girl bought this really cool long sleeve, these tearaway blue pants. And this other person bought these two pairs of jeans. So these very cute Y2K jeans and these vintage rustler high-waisted mom jeans i am shipping out from my website a pink tote bag and a black tote bag with the pastel pink i have another order with the pastel pink and one more order with the black and pastel pink also my website are exclusive for my two piece sets and i if you haven't seen my website i have it linked in the description it's www.lissisline.com I'm going to go ahead and start packaging these orders. I always fold all of the clothing items first. So that's what I'm going to do right now. to yarn everything these i am actually just gonna put in a box so i'm going to wrap up everything with my fuzzy fuzzy pink yarn buy shoes and they have the markings on them for when you buy them you want to take the price off use a acetone remover a nail polish remover that's 100 percent acetone and it will take it off do not use one that is non-acetone because it doesn't really work i tried it but if you use the acetone just be careful with your nails of course and also be careful with the paint on the shoe so just try and get the area that just has the price because it does take the paint off at the same time. It takes it right off, there's nothing on there, but it also takes off the paint. So just be careful, let it dry. You already know alcohol dries pretty quickly. These are my polymellers for my website. I designed this myself on Canva and I just put a custom measurement and I actually use my thermal labels from my Rolo. my Depop cards as well as my new business cards. I did do Vistaprint. If you have been keeping up with me, it's on my vlogs. I did say I was going to try Vistaprint now for making a thank you cards because I used to make them myself. If you haven't seen my video, this is how they came out. I got the postcard size and I love them. They're so cute. They're so easy. You get a lot for a pretty cheap price. So I will link a Vistaprint link in the description so you guys can get your hands on some cards and i think you will get a discount and then i will get some credits for their website or something like that but just keeping it transparent with you guys that's what it is if not just go to vistaprint.com sign up for their emails and they usually give you good discounts so this is not sponsored by them or nothing like that they just give you a shareable link so you can get some credits off your next purchase and i got these stickers and the goodie bags with each order i put some in here as well for my website orders and yeah that's how it looks i'm gonna go ahead and poly mail everything print out some shipping labels and that is that i'll be done 
the finished result. So I have my Depop orders and my website orders. And this is how they look. So I just finished eating. I'm gonna fix up my hair a little bit. I have this little red spot here because I was scratching myself, but I'm gonna go ahead and go to the post office after. I'm gonna bring you guys with me, of course. I'm gonna record some videos. This is a real day in the life. And just once I'm done finishing recording, I'm going to probably take some more product pictures outside because it is a sunny day, but it is very, very windy. I am going to hopefully do good at vlogging today, hopefully okay so it is very very cold outside i have my orders in the back i'm gonna go drop them off and i really want to go christmas shopping and i want to show you guys i bought most of the stuff that i want to buy but i want to get one thing for my little cousin and i also want to get some pillows for my parents because they really need some new pillows and my mom wants some like decorative pillows for Roz. So I wanna see if she's home and take her shopping real quick. My buy stop by the thrift store, I don't know. I'm gonna call my mama right now because my phone is dying. I am rocking the no makeup look today and I am just going to put on my glasses and go. I don't really like these glasses with this outfit, honestly. I keep sunglasses on deck. These are so dirty, but these might be better. No? I don't like this vibe? Do you like that vibe? Maybe this vibe? I don't like that vibe either. But I'm gonna wear these for now. So, I am going to go to the stores. Let's go. Just bought a couple gifts that I wanted. I already went Christmas shopping a lot, but I don't think I want to show you just because I think my family watches my videos. But I did get me some cute sunglasses. I always wanted these square sunglasses. And I was thinking like $15 for these cheap ass sunglasses, whatever. But I always wanted these really cute bougie square ones. So I finally got me some. I only got me some of these and add to my crazy sunglass collection. Yay! It's getting a little cloudy outside, so I'm about to go in. I just got here and I've been to this one recently, but I actually got a coupon for spending, I think like $50 here. And I'm bringing my bags with me, of course. I got my black tote bag from this morning when I was dropping off orders and I also got my pink tote bag. I always use my tote bags. I've been wanting to show you guys for the longest time some cute tote bags that I made for thrifting and also for dropping off your orders or for going grocery shopping or whatever you want. Just a little badass tote bag. So I'm gonna bring these inside with me. Let's go and hopefully we can find some cute stuff. I got my mask and let's go. Okay, so I like to start off in the jog wear because lately I've been trying to find a lot of two-piece sets for my website. And I'm gonna just look at sweaters and maybe some like pants because I don't have any more cute pants and hopefully maybe some boots. This two-piece set is so cute, but it has all this on front. And I don't know if this comes off. It doesn't look like it, so I'm not gonna get it. But this is so fire. I love that. And then this one's cute too, but it doesn't have a string. And I don't feel like going to look for one, but a brown basic two-piece is always fire. I found this really cute cardigan i'm gonna crop this and i love the ruffled up detail so that's really cute 
All right, so I found this really cute dress. This is a just a silk dress. It's by Victoria's Secret, and it's 100% silk. And it's a large. I wish it fit me. I found this cute cheetah print blazer jacket. And then I found this really cool um, vintage Alfred Dunner. It's always really nice to find because they always have a lot of cool prints and embroidery. So I really like this jacket and then this plaid blazer it's half off so it's already five dollars so it'll be 250 and i love this print and the exercise section and this is just to let you guys know to never not look in every section because i found these really cute skorts so i found this really cool nike one i love this gingham print and then i found this really cute adidas one it's like a pistachio green it's a schoolgirl kind of style i love this tinny skirt and then i found this really cute a-line red skirt and i love that little patch and yeah i thought this would be really form-fitting this one doesn't have any shorts underneath though make sure you always look at the warm stuff because it's always warm somewhere in a different part of the country or world so you never know who will pick up some stuff in a warmer climate like for example people who live in texas or california or something like that where they have longer summer months so yeah always look at the shorts and like tank tops and stuff like that right, so, so yeah. i'm about to leave after this but i found this really cute cardigan it's kind of cropped and then I also found this jacket. It's really, really soft and it's like that knitted material with the... Oh, it has a hole right here. Um, I'm inspected. I may or may not keep this. I found these brand new with tags Fashion Nova jeans and they look like my size. So hopefully they fit me. I love the flare. Got back and of course I used my tote bag. So I was able to fill up two of them. They're not like super full, but I was able to get all that clothes and still have room in my bag. So just to just show y'all like basically how big these bags are. They are a decent size. So you can go thrifting and stuff. So yeah, that's all I got today thank you so much for watching i'm gonna go ahead and end the video right now i hope you guys enjoyed this little day in the life and just work with me i love bringing you guys with me to run some errands and go to the thrift store and do some business things i just wanted to give you just a quick few sneak peeks and previews of a bunch of things and i'm also gonna sit down and talk to you guys about my website and how i created it and just really do a sit down update with that because i feel like i haven't had an official update or official website video for youtube so i really want to make that for you guys so you guys can really get you know the insights on everything so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video please give me a big thumbs up if you liked it make sure to subscribe i do upload two times a week and yeah that's it thank you so much for watching i'll talk to you guys in the next one bye